Fresh Squeeze Noise, Euro Rack Patch 20. So, usual setup, ABC is going to output mixer, circadian rhythm feeding the Tempe. The first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take one of the Tempe clocks and go into the trigger in on maths. And then I'm gonna take the output of channel one and go into, oops, go into the color of braids. And then I'm gonna take the output of that and go into the mixer. Uh, the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take one more of the Tempe outputs and go into the trigger in on peaks. And then I'm gonna take the output of that and go into the timbre on braids. Next, I'm gonna take one more of the Tempe outs and run it to the clock in on the sequence eight. Then I'm gonna take the CV one from uh, sequence eight and go into the one volt per octave. Next, I'm gonna take one of the uh, circadian rhythm outputs and go into the closed hi-hats uh, for mutant, or the mutant hi-hat. Then I'm gonna take the output of that and go into the mixer. And then I'm gonna uh, turn on the loop, switch to 64 mode and go to that channel. And I'm gonna add some steps. Now, I'm actually gonna take the output from mutant hi-hats and go into the dub junior. And then go from the dub junior back to the output. Next, I'm gonna take another one of the Tempe outs and go into the uh, clock in on the micro sequence. Uh, and then I'm gonna take the pitch out of that and go into the one volt per octave on the STO. Uh, and then I'm gonna take the sub output of the STO and go into the binary filter from Pittsburgh. Then I'm gonna take the output of that and go into the error box. And then I'm gonna take the output of the error box and go into the uh, mixer. I'm actually gonna take the output from the error box and go into the QVCA from Dopefer. And then I'm gonna take the output from Dopefer and go into the mixer. Uh, the next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take one of the circadian rhythm outs and go into the trigger in of the mutant bass drum. And then I'm gonna take the distorted out and then go straight into the uh, a mixer uh, then I'm gonna switch to that track and add some steps next I'm gonna take one of the outputs from circadian rhythm and go into the trigger in on the mutant snare and then I'm going to take the output from the mutant snare and go into the uh, reverb from audio damage and then take whoop, and then take the output from that and go into the mixer uh, then I'll switch to that channel and add just a couple steps. Next, I'm gonna take the end of rise and I'm gonna go into the trigger in on the DSM. And then I'm gonna take the output from that and go into clouds. Then I'm gonna take the output from that and go into the mixer. <laughs>
Thanks for watching. If you have any questions or comments, please leave those below. Also, if you have any suggestions for other modules that you think would be uh, a cool addition to my setup, please let me know. Uh, and uh, if you like what you saw and you want to see more of it, please subscribe. And until next time.